It's your girl, Sharon Fletcher, representing Caribbean Vibrations on the black carpet of the Legacy Awards. And I have with me here award nominee recipient for The Visionaire. Oh my goodness, I have Fabian Colas here, local legend, superwoman. I can't think of enough verbs to describe you. It's so great to be in your presence. How does it feel to be here? That is so nice of you. Thank you so much. It feels great. Um, I feel like it's our time and we're, we're having our own space right here in Toronto and our first uh, black uh, gala award to be on national TV. This is a historic time. Absolutely, and given that you run 12 film festivals and are known for your work in uh, diversity and inclusion and fighting, fighting anti-black racism, what does it mean to you to see black Canadians uniquely being acknowledged here today? Oh, it means everything. It is. Uh, it was about time that it happens, and here we are. And I believe it sends a strong signal of inclusion, because this type of event will showcase great black talent and will expose them to the industry in general. And that will open doors for some people that were overlooked or were ignored in this industry. Or the, we're, we're just not known. So this is a platform where a lot of people are watching and we'll be like, oh, well, we would like to hire this person. What about this person? We didn't know that person. So you see the kind of ripple effect, positive ripple effect that they can have. So I'm, put, I'm very happy about that. And it sends also a big signal about um, the fact that this gala is very inclusive. Here I am from Montreal, Francophone, and I'm here. So that is fantastic. Because a lot of time, all the great stuff in Toronto are happening, and then Montreal is not necessarily included, and vice versa. So tonight, I feel like Canada gets together. This is fantastic, and this is what it should look like, you know? So I'm super proud, and I congratulate um, CBC, the broadcaster, for having the guts to put this award on national television, um, because this is the right thing to do. Yeah. Wonderful. So being that this is Caribbean Vibrations, would you like to share us, with us if you have any Caribbean connection, favorite foods, or places that you have been? Oh, that's unfair. That's unfair. Well, what about that? Whenever I'm in Toronto, I always, always go to Jamaican restaurants to have some uh, jerk chicken. This is a must. Um, we have a lot of Haitian restaurants in Montreal, but very few Jamaican restaurants. So when I come to Toronto, that's my time to just dive into Jamaican food. Yeah, your Jamaican fix. And Caribbean, Caribbean food in general. Well, I want to thank you for, you know, the award that you're winning is so namely being a visionary. As I said, running 12 uh, film festivals, and I don't know how you do it all and looking gorgeous. Look at you. But it's so great to see you, and thank you for being thank with you. us here on Caribbean Vibrations. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you.